Hey, how are you? Pretty good, Dick. This is it. Yes, people are probably wondering about our attire. I suppose they are, but before and, uh, we tell them about that, let's yeah. welcome them uh, to this edition of our magazine, being a Thanksgiving it edition. Is, yeah. All right, now. Can I wish you a happy Thanksgiving? Uh, well, I, I thought I would help you celebrate Thanksgiving with some Aikido. Oh, uh, I love that, especially un- with a little dressing on the side. Oh, please be sorry. reverent. Okay. And uh, Aikido means, in fact, if the best way to translate it, I guess, would be way of harmony. But, uh, but it's a martial art. It's perfect for Thanksgiving, in a sense, because it will change you. It will help reduce your stress. It'll give you confidence. It'll oh, increase your respectability. On. I saw that thing you did with Mark Gastineau. That was did so you? phony. Come on. Uh, okay, now that Can you brought that Can you imagine Mark up. Gastineau, the linebacker for the Jets, not being able to lift Mr. Cavett? He could lift me, and then thanks to Furuya Sensei, who taught me how to become unliftable, Mark Gastineau said, I'm going to say, I'll, I'll seem heavier this time. He said, I'm going to tell the truth. And he goes... And he couldn't get you up. All right, we'll yeah, find no out way. why he couldn't get him up. Why? All right, also today, once we have reduced our stress and got into harmony with all the elements in our life, we're going to have a chance to hear about his latest venture, and that's the new College Bowl. Ah, you know of this, too. Yes, of course. All this and more in today's edition of Our Magazine. Show us a little bit about the art of Aikido is Daniel Furuya, chief instructor of the Aikido Center of Los Angeles in downtown Little Tokyo. And of course, I think you're a teacher, right, Dick? Yes, when I'm in California, if I lived here, I would be every day at the Aikido Center of Los Angeles. It's just wonderful. Thanks. Nice to have you on this, Daniel. This is one of the best teachers in the world. All right, uh, I, I, I don't say the best because he's modest. Yeah, but isn't his father uh, the gentleman? That no, was... actually, I, but he studied with what is known as Doshu, that is the son of the founder of oh, Aikido. Right. So uh, Daniel is um, in the direct line in the sense that uh, the founder of Aikido, Ishii So Bamori he knows Day. what he knows and probably and has his son passed it on that. to him yeah. and he will pass it on to us. How long have you worked together? Oh, about uh, two, two and a half years now, I think. Yeah, I looked in the yellow pages under Aikido. <laughs> uh, under Actually, it's under Karate, which is a separate story. And... Uh, found uh, Daniel, and he has the most beautiful dojo, as the GM, we would call it, is We don't really want to go into Either that. in or out of Tokyo. <laughs> okay. no, you, you must come over someday. Now, Aikido is different from, I guess, the karate as we know it, or our perception of karate, because it's it's not an aggressive, or, or I have the, one has the feeling karate is aggressive, there's lots of punches and so forth. This is completely different, is it not? Exactly. Uh, most martial arts um, uh, are fighting arts, but uh, the founder of Aikido tried to change it and create a martial art which is both a physical and spiritual or mental discipline. Mm-hmm. And through his efforts, he created Aikido. And Aikido is non aggressive, there's no competition, its main emphasis is personal development, and uh, it works towards uh, peace in the world and getting man to work. Together with Not to mention men. keeping yourself out of harm's way if that should happen. Exactly. And, you can, and yeah. I'm sure you have uh, women students as well, do you not? Many women students. Uh, my youngest student is four and a half years old, and my eldest student is 74 and a half. All right, let's talk about one of the elders, and this is the master. We have him on tape. Uh, let's take a look at that, and I, I don't know if Daniel is going to... Here it is, right uh-huh. here. Great. What's this happen- is uh, Ueshiba Kishomaru Sensei. He is the... Grandmaster of Aikido, the successor to his father, the founder of Aikido, Ueshiba Morihei. And uh, currently he is the director of the Aikido World Headquarters in Tokyo, Japan, and the chairman of the International Aikido Federation, which covers dojos all over the world. Now, do si do. There's, there's, uh, he probably has about looks like. 500,000 students all over the world. And he's using their energy. Exactly. And uh, he's in his early 70s. Yeah. It's, it's interesting that you said do si do because people often watch and say, well, that guy fell because he meant to fall. Uh, the, guy, the old guy just touched him. When somebody puts Nikyo on your wrist or something, which is what he's doing, or uh, you will see why someone will do 360 degrees in the air to keep from his arm from breaking. All right, well, let's the attack has to be real or he'd throw you out of So in other words, I have to, let's say, for example, I'm going to do something mm-hmm. uh, with Daniel. I have to really throw my mind and body and everything into it as if this is really yeah. the, uh, for real. The 
technique doesn't work unless the attack is real. It's a, right. it's a very effective art, but it also teaches you that you don't have to fight and you don't have to resort to violence to solve your problems. You All can right. do it in a Let's rational... Let's do a little demo. With, sure, with, for with instance... You and, okay, you grab and my wrist. All right. And what Norm, do you want me to do? Hold well, strongly. Hold, yeah. Hold strongly. And, what, and normally, uh, we want to resist. Yeah. This is how we fight. Yeah. But in Aikido, it's just relax. Oh, oh gee, <laughs> I'm telling Are you, you <laughs> next week's host well, will be... <laughs> we're, we're gonna lower the speed limit here, folks. Yeah. That was so fast. I was so intent on your arm. I didn't know what was going on. Yeah. Isn't that interesting, that, the principle of fighting somewhere else than where you're yeah. attacked? Is the the best thing? form of fighting is non-fighting. Okay, well, that, it that, certainly that's, worked there. And uh, we, we, try to, we try to be peaceful people in this world, but we always resort to violence. Aikido shows you how to right. not resort I'm to not violence. I'm not going to go after your hand. And when he tells that to your lawyer. <laughs> yes, right. All right, now, you know, I know you brought some of your students, and sure. I think teachers, probably they're teachers. Uh, they're my assistants. Your assistants. And mm -hmm. if you would introduce them to us, please, Daniel, uh, sure. they'll come out and we'll have a little uh, demonstration of Aikido. Great. Sure. Uh, this is, these are my assistants at the Aikido Center of Los Angeles in Little Tokyo, uh, Mr. Douglas Firestone. Oh, nice to have you with us. Ms. Uh, Mitsuko Yoshimoto and Mr. Kazuho Nishida. All right, great. Nice to have you with us. All right, let's see uh, a little demo here. Okay. Um, does Dick want to do something? I'll, I'll do, do something. something? Okay. I will. So that, that, that work with you or with... Okay. Oh, okay, let's grab, grab here. Other side. No, come this way. Okay, we want, this way. we want the people to, to see. To, no, come. Face. Face you? Face me. Okay. Oh, so this is the two-man two thing. Oh, oh, Lord. Okay. okay. This is quite... This is, believe it or not, possible. How about she? It's okay? That's fabulous. That's wonderful. <laughs> Thank you. Hey. Now that's what you worry about all the time, is somebody come up, coming up from behind you. Look at this, like a dance. Daniel, that seems so effortless. Oh, it is. Easy. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, my gosh. That's terrific. Daniel right, he volunteered for this. And his Thank you very much. Associate Daniel, that is marvelous. Very Thank nice you. Could we show you why yes. someone fell when you yes, think I, you should? Yes, because it looks so effortless. Tell what this is. This is called Kote Can you feel the pressure here? Of course I can. If I yeah. put my hand here quite gently, an 87-year-old lady in this position, yeah. with no strength, will bring you down oh, quite slowly. Oh, yeah. Mike, do that again. Isn't that remarkable? I'm starting to like it now. <laughs> <laughs> Dick. Yeah. Yeah. Now, I'm using no no strength at all. And the thing I did with Mike Jeez. Tyson. We stand here, Daniel, explain what's happening here. You the did this with Mike between, Tyson, the boxer, the, the guy that's like this? Or would you rather see what a young lady can do? Would that Let's be see what a convincing? young lady can do. Yes. All right, we have to do this as quickly as yes. we can. Okay. I can do this. Real fast. Aikido is quite... What do you want? You oh, want I just going to have her show how a, a, a young woman can, in fact, oh. throw a large oh, man. Oh, okay. Oh, is she going to throw me? Oh. Oh, that, probably not. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> because uh, she's very dangerous. I'm really into this stuff she's now, She's very folks. dangerous. You fought the lion. Okay, huh? you take two. Okay. Watch your head there. All right, well, it's obvious it's working. Thank you very much, Daniel, and to your staff, very, very much. Believe that. Now, we're going to be talking about the about the college bowl. So for we toss will. Up, what's coming up next? You know, uh, what's coming up next? I, I think is uh, that I'm going to. We're going to talk about college bowl, and we will see some of oh, the old college bowl and some of the new college bowl. And somewhere in that, I'll show you why Mike Tyson couldn't hold my arm okay, down. Okay. All right. We'll be right back. Thanks, Daniel. <laughs>